When we first moved to Talgum, we came into town, we walked into the store, and the first thing Charlie said to me is, I want this store. It's the day that COVID shut everything down, we took the store on. Yeah. We weren't sure whether we were mad or whether it would be a good thing. It's not about the money. It's definitely not about the money for us. It's about local community yeah, and what we can do for them, because we just love Talgum. No intentions of ever going anywhere. When we first initially were looking at the business, we were thinking, okay, we need to introduce a lot more foods into the business, like dining and takeaway. We just wanted to change the way that food was being presented. It was all pre-bought, but we're not about that. We're about everything cooked ourselves on premises. Our employee, Will, came to us and said, we've got this good friend of ours that makes these beautiful award-winning jams. Would you be interested? And we went, yeah, sure, give it a go. Let's see how it goes. We got the jams in and just went, wow, they're amazing. I'm Benita. I live in charge of the nursery here. I'm very passionate about getting the trees back in the ground and restoring natural ecosystems. We're trying to have a bit of a theme with the nursery for Indigenous plants for bees, so prop pollinators and the butterflies and the birds, so plants that feed wildlife uh, and also just that support local ecology as well as edibles, so fruit trees, culinary herbs and bush tucker. We are bringing the community together and giving the community a space that they can come feel safe no matter what background you come from, what nationality you are, and what your sexual preference is, anything, like you can feel safe here. Yeah, yeah, I'm most proud of that, I think.